بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹ ویلکم ٹو مائی یوٹیوب چینل لرن ود اعظم ٹو ڈے وی ول ڈسکس اباؤٹ نیو سلیبس فزکس ایس ایس سی ٹو یونٹ نمبر ٹویلو جیومیٹریکل آپٹکس ان ایس ایل او بیس اور اکارڈنگ ٹو ایف بی آئی ایس سی ریکوائرمنٹ نمیریکل پرابلم ٹو ڈے وی ول ڈسکس کوشچن نمبر سکس ٹو نائن ان پارٹ ففتھ سو فرسٹ آف آل اکارڈنگ ٹو دا گیون اسٹیٹمنٹ آف کوشچن نمبر سکس این آبجیکٹ از پلیس تھرٹی سینٹی میٹر ان فرنٹ آف کنورجنگ لینس اینڈ دین ٹویلو پوائنٹ فائیو سینٹی میٹر ان فرنٹ آف ڈائیورجنگ لینس بوتھ لینس ہیو آ فوکل لینتھ ٹین سینٹی میٹر فار بوتھ کیسز فائنڈ دا امیج ڈسٹینس اینڈ آلسو میگنیفیکیشن ڈسکرائب دا امیج ناؤ فرسٹ آف آل رائٹ دا گیون ڈیٹا ان گیون ڈیٹا اکارڈنگ ٹو اسٹیٹمنٹ ڈسٹینس فرام کنویکس لینس سو object distance from convex lens d not is equal to 30 cm and object distance from concave lens that is equal to d not that is equal to 12.5 cm now focal length both lens are same so focal length f is equal to 10 cm now required that in this question first of all image distance di for first lens or a convex lens and also find the magnification m and similarly we can find for the b part according to the statement image distance di and magnification m now we can find the solution first of all a part as it is knowing that 1 over f is equal to 1 over d not plus 1 over di we can find di so this implies that 1 upon di is equal to 1 upon f minus 1 upon d not putting the values So 1 over di is equal to 1 upon 10 minus 1 upon 30. Now taking the LCM, so 1 upon di is equal to 30 minus 10 and 10 multiplied by 30 that is equal to 300. Now this implies that 1 upon di is equal to 30 minus 10 that is equal to 20. 20 divided by 300 now taking the reciprocal on both sides so this implies that di is equal to 300 divided by 20 now calculate the value 300 divided by 20 that is equal to 30 cm now we can find the magnification so as it knowing that magnification m is equal to minus di over d not this implies that m is equal to minus di over d not is equal to minus 15 upon 30 so dividing the 50 by 30 that is equal to minus 0.5 now we can find the therefore the image object distance is greater than the twice the focal length so d not is greater than 2f for a convex lens here we can see that d not is greater than the focal length of two times so in this part the image distance is less than the twice of the focal length 15 cm is less than 20 cm so we have the image is real and distance is positive
सो टेकिंग द वैल्यू इट विल बी पॉजिटिव सो वी विल मूव द सेकेंड पार्ट द इमेज इज इन्वर्टेड एंड नेगेटिव सो द इमेज इज स्मॉलर देन द ऑब्जेक्ट मैग्निफिकेशन इज लेस देन वन नाउ फॉर बी पार्ट पुटिंग द वैल्यू इन इक्वेशन वन वी विल गेट हेयर फोकल लेंथ इज नेगेटिव बिकॉज वी यूज अ कंकेव लेंथ नाउ वी हैव पुटिंग द वैल्यूज एंड कैलकुलेट दैट एज वी नो दैट वन अपॉन एफ इज इक्वल टू वन अपॉन डी नॉट प्लस वन अपॉन डी आई दिस इम्प्लाइज दैट वन अपॉन डी आई इज इक्वल टू वन अपॉन एफ माइनस वन अपॉन डी नॉट पुटिंग द वैल्यूज वन अपॉन माइनस टेन माइनस वन अपॉन ट्वेल्व पॉइंट फाइव नाउ टेकिंग द एल्सियम then 1 upon di is equal to 12.5 minus minus plus that is equal to 10 divided by 125 this implies that 1 upon di is equal to 22.5 so 22.5 divided by minus 125 this implies that taking the reciprocal on both side di is equal to minus 125 divided by 22.5 so the answer is minus 5.555 that is equal to minus 5.56 cm now calculate the magnifying power so it is knowing that magnification m is equal to minus di divided by d naught this implies that m is equal to minus di divided by d naught is equal to minus 5.5 divided by 12.5 so answer is minus 0.445 here we can see that answer is negative value therefore in a concave lens the image is virtual erect and smaller in the size of object so we will move the question number 7 in question number 7 according to the given statement an 8 cm focal length of converging lens is used as a jeweler loop so which is the magnifying glass estimate the magnification and when the i is relaxed and the if i is focused near to the point so first of all write the given data focal length f is equal to 8 cm near point of the distance n is equal to 25 cm so we have required that first of all in a part magnification when i is relaxed then m and in b part magnification when i is focused at near the point of m so we can solve this question magnifying so magnification when i is relaxed it is given that the formula m theta is equal to m divided by f here n is the near point of distance and f is the focal length putting the values m theta is equal to 25 divided by 8 that is equal to 3.12 now we can find magnification when i is focused at near the point is given by m theta is equal to n divided by f plus 1 so putting the values m theta is equal to 25 divided by 8 plus 1 so 25 divided by 8 that is equal to 3.12 plus 1 so the answer is 4.12 now we will move the question number 8 in question number 
if the focal length of eye piece is increased does the magnitude of magnification is increase or decrease check your response by calculating the magnification when the focal length of eye piece is 3.5 cm now according to the given statement we use the given data in example 12.8 so we write that the given data focal length of objective f not is equal to 1 cm near point distance that is n is equal to 25 cm so we have distance of image di is equal to 1.1 cm and focal length of i is 3.5 cm now required that effect on magnification and what is the magnification now in solving the solution first of all find di so first we find the image distance by using the formula as it in knowing that 1 over f is equal to 1 over d not plus 1 over di this implies that 1 over di is equal to 1 over f minus 1 over di that is equal to 1 divided by 1 minus 1 divided by 1.1 taking the lcm so 1.1 minus 1 divided by 1 multiplied by 1.1 so this implies that 1 upon di is equal to 0.1 divided by 1.1 so taking reciprocal on both side di is equal to 1.1 divided by 0.1 1.1 divided by 0.1 so answer is 11 cm now we will have the magnification of compound microscope is given by the formula m is equal to minus di divided by d not multiply by n upon fe so we can use the equation for the magnification of compound microscope is inversely proportional to the focal length of i piece so we have calculated that if the focal length of i piece is increased then the magnification will be decreased now in b part find the magnification putting the values in equation 1 then we have m is equal to minus di over d not multiply by n upon fe putting the values then m is equal to minus 11 divided by 1.1 multiply by 25 divided by 3.5 so multiplying the statement m is equal to minus 275 divided by 3.5 2.275 divided by 3.5 that is equal to minus 78.57 so the answer of magnification m is equal to minus 79 now today last question question number 9 an astronomical telescope has the following specification f not is equal to 985 mm and f not is 5 mm from the data we can find the angular magnification and the approximate length of the telescope so first of all write the given data focal length of object that is f not is equal to 985 mm and the focal length of i piece that is equal to fe is equal to 5 mm now required that angular magnification m theta and the length of scope so we have write the solution first of all in a part we know that the angular magnification of telescope is given by m theta is equal to minus 
एफ नॉट डिवाइड बाई एफ ई सो दैट इज इक्वल टू माइनस नाइन एटी फाइव डिवाइड बाई फाइव सो एम थीटा इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन नाइनटी सेवन एंड इन बी पार्ट एज वी नो दैट द फोकल लेंथ ऑफ टेलीस्कोप इज गिवन बाय सो दैट इज इक्वल टू एल एल इज इक्वल टू एफ नॉट प्लस एफ ई putting the values then 985 plus 5 that is equal to 990 mm so here 6 to 9 numerical are completed in other numerical in other video best of luck